What is going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today we have news on the Iron Banner and the Leviathan Prestige Mold Raid. But before we get into the video guys, do you want to win some epic loot? I've got emblem cards, I've got sparrow cards, I've got gift cards, I've got much much more. To win some simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so this info comes from Bungie's weekly update and it talks about Iron Banner. It talks about the raid, so let's get into it. Okay, so starting on October 10th, 2 a.m. Pacific, Iron Banner will be here. So what is different? Well, combat will be between two teams of four players, as we know all PvP mods are now. Your fighting abilities, not your power levels, will decide the outcome so unlike Iron Banner in Destiny 1, your level doesn't matter, just your skills. Bounties and ranks with the Iron Banner have been replaced with Iron Banner engrams. This is what you need to do to compete in the Iron Banner. You need to complete the Destiny 2 campaign. This is the only way to reach the tower and seek out Lord Saladin. You have to visit Lord Saladin in the tower to begin the Iron Banner quest. Fight in the Iron Banner playlist with quick play modes and match making. What's in it for us? Earn Iron Banner tokens in every match. Earn more if you win. Daily and season milestones that track your progress to glory. Claim brand new armor made in the forges of the Iron Lords. Decorate yourself as a master of your competitive spirit. Form up into a fire team or let the fates choose your fire teams. The game mode is control, so this should be pretty fun. And look on screen now, we can see the gear and it looks absolutely incredible, people. Check this out. Me being a hunter, I am super happy with the look of it. But I'm guessing, guys, those of you who are warlocks and those of you who are titans are also just as happy because all the armor, in my opinion, looks absolutely incredible. And imagine what this will look like with some of the shaders that are available in game now. I cannot wait, people. I seriously can't. But yes, that is the info on Iron Banner. But people, it doesn't end there. The ultimate PvE challenge also arrives in your director on Tuesday at 10 a.m. Pacific. This will be roughly 5 to 6 p.m. UK time. And that is the prestige version of the Leviathan Raid. Now the recommended light on the Leviathan Raid prestige mod is 300. It states the ultimate test of might and metal. Enemies are stronger and smarter and new mechanics will require new strategies. Bungie in the update go on to say we do not expect everyone to be successful in completing this activity. Mechanical changes to the encounters are minimal but they are there. The prestige raid is about mastering a more punishing sandbox. Our goal is not to provide a boon to your character progression, but there are unique rewards to help you shine. Consider this your invitation to prove to the world that you are among the very best of the raiders who overlook the city. World's first will be counted. We can tell you no more. So next week's weekly reset, we get Iron Banner. Eight hours after that, we get the Prestige Mode Raid, which I can just not wait for, people. I seriously can't. But yeah, next week is going to be a seriously busy week for sure. Iron Banner, Prestige Mode Raid, which are you looking most forward to? For me personally, I think it's Iron Banner looking at this gear. I mean, it's just unbelievable. But yes, guys, that is it for another video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leaving a like really does help me out. If you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos, be sure to subscribe. If you never want to miss a video I upload, hit that bell button next to that subscribe button to receive email notifications of when I do upload. But thanks, as always, for stopping by, people. And hopefully, I will see you on that next one.